Hey guys, Nick Monalon here, and today I'm going to show you all of my tasks and profiles in Tasker and show you how some of the main ones work. And then if you want any more details on how specifically they work or some more refined details, then just leave a comment and I'll make a new video explaining them. So here we have home when I'm connected and not low battery. The reason I have that is, is because I use the battery saver on Lollipop. And if you use that, then it stops connecting to Wi-Fi when your phone is off, which causes problems. So when that happens, I set an icon, set volumes, do a dash clock thing, set a notification auto wear, which is for my Moto 360, do some more volumes, and then flash that. And then when I get back, it, or when I leave, it changes some other stuff and then cancels the notification home. Then I have Work Connected, which is just the state of connected, and it sends the all uh, different notifications, and depending where I am, it flashes other ones, and then this just cancels all of them. I don't really use that one. This one is just for my Motorola Buds, and when it doesn't have wear, it just creates a little scene like that, so I can open an app, those two apps if I want to. Then there's one that has where where it just creates a notification on my watch so I can start playing music. Then there's charge device, so percent ten percent it just says to not forget. Then charging I have which sets some variables and does some other stuff. And then don't use that. Um this just basically closes all the windows and auto wear. Uh, let's see. This is a reminder to feed the animals at 5 o'clock and when I'm home. This is a button I can press on auto wear on my watch that will make uh, the phone go to the lollipop easter egg using auto input and taps. Headphones just when it gets plugged in and it's not wear, it does the same thing with the scene. Then there's the wear, which same thing as the Bluetooth one. Home and low, like I said before, is for the low battery, but I'm still home with the Lollipop. Battery saver, home connect is when I don't have it on, but I'm near it, so it'll just turn it off, turn Wi-Fi on when I'm off. Uh, I haven't been using that one. Low battery just sets my battery every single 10 seconds, or 10 minutes when I'm not charging, and... This also sets a variable. Good morning during the weekdays is when I'm at when it's seven, I'm home and there's no alarm set. Then it goes through and says these different uh, weather and day and different things like that. And then I have one that has me recorded saying okay Moto X and then the uh, what's up so that way it'll play the whole thing. Then also I have it where at 8.30, it'll ask me if I want to be reminded of anything, and then I'll show the scene, and that will let me enter in something, which then I'll say it in the morning. Right here, don't forget. Then these are just two things that set the different weathers in the API. Then there's weekend, which is at 8 o'clock instead of 7. Uh, this lets me tap an NFC tag, which then... Set, let me lets me set an alarm with a uh, scene. Then there's this, which just opens music and does taps to start playing a playlist. This creates a notification at pocket. Then there's this, which lets me post and Instagram my voice. Then there's school, which changes my volumes to zero and then creates a notification and just gets rid of that with the ending. Then they also have Skull Connect, same as Home Connect. Don't know what that does really, but anyway. This is where when I have it on, facing downwards, and like on a desk, then it turns the screen off. Um, send an inbox with my voice. When I'm home, when I'm not home, and it's between 9 and 11, it'll send... And I'm at 3%, and it'll send my parents that my battery's low and my phone's about to die. This just does the same thing as other ones. 
Uh, this reminds me to take my trash out at Thursday when I'm home. Um, these are this is all auto voice stuff that works with my watch and Google Now. Then there's all these wear stuff that basically just there are a whole bunch of different buttons I have. This is the old way I used to connect, and then lots of different things. So that's about it, guys. Oh, actually, this is a uh, scene I'm th playing on making an app. So it's basically a uh, bank app. So you can set your total balance. And then you can add a deposit or a purchase. So if I do that, say 26, or on 12, 6, 14, click it, then I'll add it there. And if I, for example, add enough of these, then I can actually scroll through like a regular list. Which is really cool. I'm actually pretty happy with this. And yeah. So about it guys if you want to know any more details or how to do certain things just let me know and thanks goodbye